All right, folks. So we're nearing the end of this match here. Nearing the end of the match. We got a lot of people with vehicles, by the way. A ridiculous amount of vehicles. We're only down to top we're 27. Oh, my God. Dude, that is an exorbitant amount of people to be alive for how small the circle is right now. So, yeah. We'll have to see how things go here. See if we can squash some people trying to move in from the blue ring. Probably got some people in these houses right here, I bet. I'm not seeing anybody to squish. Oh, shit. Did you hear that? Yeah, I'm not seeing anyone to squish. I don't know where the gunfire gunfire came from. Oh, God, it'll flip the vehicle. Did you see that? Dude, the frame rate is so low. Dude, the frame rate right now is about five frames per second. Are you kidding me? Dude, this is ridiculous. Look how bad it is. Come on, man. They can't do better than this. Look how bad... Dude, this is so impossible to fucking control right now. This is so... Like, there's, if there was a person walking directly in front of me, I wouldn't be able to control the vehicle and hit him. This is stupid. Fuck off. Oh, my God. Well, there we go. Top 20. <clears throat> First match, top 20. This guy's looking for people, too. We're looking for people to squish. We can't find any. People must have gotten a lot better about... about oh, fuck. A lot better about not getting, you know, not getting in the, in the way of vehicles or being sneaky. All right. I see people are talking about Fortnite. I'm going to be honest, guys. I really don't like Fortnite because of the building aspect of it. I think it's terrible. I think it takes away from the game. Being able to just instantly build walls and fucking giant, you know, stairwells and shit. It's fucking stupid. I see people, oh, here's an epic Fortnite end of game. And it's like for the last five minutes, people just spamming walls and shit and jumping with rockets and stuff. It's fucking stupid. I don't like it. I don't like that kind of gameplay at all, man. Oh, fucking shit. Well, that sucked. Dude, I have like no health now. Look how much health I just lost. Are you serious? I can't believe I just lost that much health. I gotta heal quickly. Hurry up. All right, go. Motherfucker. <laughs> All right, top 13. Oh, fuck. No, no, no. Dude, come on. Look how much damage he just did. So I just healed and immediately lost the health again. What a bunch of bullshit. Dude, how is he kidding me? Bullshit. It's fucking garbage. This is garbage. This is fucking garbage, dude. SKS. So he's got the best sniper rifle in the game. And he's magically hitting me when I'm driving full speed. Whatever, dude. Stupid. Stupid. Well, it is what it is, I guess. It is what it is. All right. So let's update everything. So... Let's update everything here. Sadly, subs went down. We're down to 436. But the top cheer is now a tie. We got... Jimmy Boys and... Dr. Soundwave. Both with 1K, thank you very much. And then top tip, we currently have for tips, we're up to 15. The top tip is Dooley.
Okay, there we go. Fully updated. Nice. Okay. Jumping back in. Thank you guys very much so far for your cheer subs and tips on the stream. That was only the first match. Oh boy. Many more to come. Alrighty. Shout out to Jonathan Rojas, who just did a 200-bit cheers at How's It Going, Phil. It is going good, Jonathan. Looking forward to a fun, interactive day with you guys on stream. You know, right now in PUBG, later on tonight, Call of Duty. First game, top top 13, not so bad. Although, I think I could have done better, honestly. Kind of fucking sniping me perfectly. It's kind of annoying, especially when I'm driving full speed. Okay. Ah. What did I do? Oh, I screwed it up. All right, hold on. I'll fix that in a second. I'm just trying to get my ch fucking Twitch chat to work right now. It's glitching out again. Can be annoying. Hold on. There we go. Whoa. Jonathan Rojas says, I'm putting my daughter's crib together and I have you on in the background. Hopefully your daughter's not around. This fucking gunfire is ridiculous. <laughs> the gunfire is so loud in this game. So b blaringly loud. <clears throat> Yeesh. All right, so I'm getting a, a couple requests. All right, I'm getting a couple requests for to actually try to do team games today. All right, how about this? After this match, I will either do duos or teams. How about that? What do you guys think? I'll do it. Just for variety's sake. So that way we have some different stuff on today's session. Rather than just solo, solo, solo. I'll do duos and teams tonight. There you go. People are getting excited now. I'm going to do it right after. All right. So one more solo, then we'll switch it up. There you go. T. Grabber says, if I make top 10 today, I'll sub. I probably will make top 10 today. I almost consistently make top 10 when I play player on those battlegrounds. In fact, I would have made top 10 that freaking game if not for bullshit at the end there. So, <clears throat> All right. Well, I see someone's dropping over there. If I go further out here, maybe I'll be further away. I don't have to deal with them. Where am I? Okay, the up. Wow, northwest. I don't think I've ever dropped this far northwest, have I? I don't know. Derek is asking who made the cheer pop up notifications. The cheer and sub notifications were both made by Popsicolo. Ramen just cheered and says, good luck in your goals. Which is your favorite persona out of the three that you played? Uh, probably five. Five is, is pretty much streamlined. It's more modernized. It's the best. I am really disappointed I did not get to finish it last year, but maybe I will this year. There seems to be quite a lot of downtime this year between new releases, so maybe I'll go back to it this year because from what I have to understand, Atlas really is not doing anything with copyrights anymore with the game, so... I might be able to play it this year at some point. I would love to. Okay. Sure, I better just pick this up so I have a gun. Okay. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Where the hell am I? There's stuff across the street, but I'm not done over here yet. <clears throat> here we go. So if I resumed my, my Persona 5 playthrough, would people come back to watch? I'm just curious, because remember, you know, now that I'm doing the more interactive style streams or whatever, right? Um, And the shout-outs and everything constantly. Those, I mean, I'll be honest, I was having a lot of fun playing that game last year. 
And people really enjoyed watching me play it, and then I had to fucking stop, which was horse shit. Um, would you guys come out to watch me play Persona 5 again, or is the game so dead at this point that no one would care, you know? What do you guys think? Mr. Swaggin says, don't deny the fact that playing prop hunt in Call of Duty is what elevated your skill. <laughs> I don't think it was prop hunt. I think it was I like, switched weapons. Because I just kept using the bar, the bar, the bar, the bar, the bar. And then finally people were saying, okay, the STG's better. Use it. I switch it immediately. I'm whooping ass. Just like getting insane kill, you know. Insane kill death ratios. It's just nuts. You know. So... Yeah, hold on a second. Okay, there we go. Oh, uh, let's see here. Jonathan Rojas. So, hold on. Now my stream chat's all screwed up. Jonathan Rojas cheered and said a small bounty. If I make the top 25, he'll give me a $10 tip, top 10, $20 tip. Wow. Well, thank you. I will do my best, but I don't know. Right now, I'm off to a bad start with what I've got. Weapon J did a 50 bit cheers. Are right, you ever going to play Fortnite again? Nope. I do not like that game. I've explained. I hate, I absolutely hate the building mechanic of that game. First of all, the game is such a small map compared to, to PUBG. There's not a lot of opportunity for me to, like, interact with you guys, you know? Because it's so small of a map. Constantly, immediately the map, the fight starts. Oh, my God, there's people all around me. I got to dodge. I got to try to grab a weapon. I got to do everything I can to try to survive right away, you know? It's so action intense because the maps are so small. Oh, my God, are you serious? I got to move. It's so action intense because the maps are so small that I don't really have opportunity to have fun with you guys and interact. Like I'm doing right now, right? I can read your cheers. I can, I can talk to you. I can interact. I can't do that when I'm playing that game because at any moment I'm just going to get fucking owned. It's pretty ridiculous. Um, plus, I just don't like the building. I don't like the on the fly. I can just build walls and shit. It's so fucking stupid and cartoony and lame. You know? Like It just doesn't seem like a, like a realistic fun game. A cartoony, stupid game. For people who want to just fucking build walls and do stupid shit. Sorry, I don't I don't think that a good shooter game, at the end of the round, someone builds fucking 12 walls and jumps off fucking staircases while shooting rockets. It's so dumb. I don't like that at all. So, it's not my cup of tea. I'm not saying people don't have a right to like it. They absolutely do. If you love, po uh, you know, Fortnite, good for you. For me, I just, I just like it. I don't like it. Okay, I just don't. So, no, I'm not going to be uh, going back and playing it. Um, I could really use a backpack. I'm just saying. Fucking shit. All right. Shout out to Dr. Soundwave who just did a 2,000 bit cheer. Yes, Dr. Soundwave. Indeed, you are today's cheerleader uh, for the stream. Thank you very much for the support. And I am boned because I am so far away from the play area. I have to find a vehicle or I'm fucked. So let's see what happens here. <laughs> 